Ride the wind. Here is a walk around video to your Nexus. So if you purchase from us and you forget some of the features, this is a feature video. So this is the steering wheel version. You've got your gas and your brakes. They're a little close together. That takes just a little bit to get used to, but you do need to use your parking brake. Okay. So key on it says, welcome. Here you are. And you've got a few features here. So you've got your drive, neutral, reverse. And to be quite honest, when you when you stop your 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 Nexa, you don't have to put it into neutral. You can leave it into drive, just so you know that it won't do anything. Okay. Your steering wheel, you've got your lights on this side. Hard to see, but it twists just like a car. And your signals. Left right and they turn off once you're done your turn they turn off just like a vehicle and now you've got your wipers on this side all the way up it has the windshield i'm out of windshield fluid but this is where you fill your windshield fluid just in there so that's kind of nice now you have your heat so your fan dial is on this side that's all the way to third second first off and so if you want heat you turn on your heat if you want cool, you turn on your cool. Got your fog lamps. So on your gauge, you've got your voltage. When you're powering up a hill, um, this is going to go lower. So if you get to red, I'm, I'm low, I do need to charge. If you get to red, um, don't worry about it, you're okay. Uh, but with lead acid batteries, you get your best performance when it's fully charged. And then as you run it down, the battery, the performance, your top speed gets slower and slower. So just know that um, you can keep it topped up. So speaking of that, how to charge. Comes with your charger. 60 volt lead acid. It's actually a pretty fast charger. 9 amp is quite, quite fast, you know. And it's just a regular charger. You don't need anything installed. And so one end of the charger goes to the wall, regular 110, and then your charging port is right here. Okay, so when you plug it in, where's the light on this? Your light is gonna be right here. Red means charging, green means it is done. So this is an overnight charge. If you've got it right down to the bottom, this is a good, this is a good 10 hours to charge and charge it till it goes green, okay? If it's still on red, keep going, okay? This is the breaker that turns off your whole, um, your whole scooter. So I guess if you're going to store it in the, uh, that was a little effort to put that back up, but it's a breaker it's supposed to, you would turn that off if you're gonna store it over the winter, if you're gonna leave it for a certain amount of time, just you can turn it off, but really it's, it's not a big deal. Okay, so I did a video with the lights at night. These light up, okay? This lights up for you um, all around, but you've got your power windows. You do need to hold it on both sides. And you've got your remote. Now this is the 2023 model, so it doesn't have the alarm showing on here, but the, they will be coming with an alarm system. They're also gonna be coming with a swivel seat, but yeah, power lock, so you can just lock it, unlock it, set your alarm which it'll give you a beep to do that so you've got your moon roof here that clicks and that comes up very nice and the back window um, opens as well if you like to circulate there we go i just had to push that in a little bit and now it stays so i'll show you this i was doing that you need to do that and now it stays up for you one seat belt in the back seat belt for the driver um, disc brake. So if you notice, um, if you get any water, you've gone through condensation, you're going to see rust on there. That's okay. They're discs. Those will wipe off. You do have your components under here, but, um, this doesn't come up like a regular trunk. It doesn't have to be, it has bolts, but that's pretty much it. To be honest, um, these move in and out. They're not powered, but at least you can fold them. Um, you have a USB over here as well. The doors open nice and wide and they also shut very nicely. Okay, let me show you one other thing is how to move the seat. So remember I said this doesn't go anywhere, but 
this is your, oh, can you take a nap? Ooh. That goes back and then it's on this side. This is your lever to go back and that's all the way back and you can go quite, quite close. But you don't even, even with this seat all the way back, you don't have to move it to have somebody come in the back. So those are your features. If I miss anything, let me know in the comments. Um, very straightforward, solid ride. You're gonna love it. Hey, if you're enjoying our content, please take a moment now and subscribe and like.